If you're looking at where we are today, I think what we've seen is Kamala Harris has said that she is for a border wall. She has said she is for fracking. She has said she's for cracking down on illegal border crossings, all during her short campaign tenure. But the truth is, is all of those things were just blocked. It's clear that her flip-flops aren't real, and there's much more to dig into and discuss as this campaign moves forward. Dale Jackson here for Yellowhammer Now. Let's talk about that video you just saw of Katie Britt standing on the floor of the United States Senate, calling out all of the Senate Democrats and basically Democrats everywhere for not actually believing the things they're saying as they campaign. I've told you about the four Ds of Democratic campaigning, and they are as follows. Deception, demonization, demographics, and dumbassery. And as you watch everything uh, that Democrats have done over the last couple of months, you will learn that all four of those things are generally in play. But it's deception that they're leaning on uh, today. As, as I said, Katie Britt laid it all out very well. All these things they said they are for, she put up to vote on, and they voted against all of them, killing it. Same thing with the IVF stuff as well. But look at Kamala Harris herself lying. I know, I know, the values haven't changed, but all the positions have. Tim Walls and I are both gun owners. We're not taking anybody's guns away. So stop with the continuous lying about this stuff. Um, I support buybacks. How mandatory is your gun buyback program? It's mandatory. I will not ban fracking. I have not banned fracking as Vice President of the United States. And in fact, I was the tie-breaking vote on the Inflation Reduction Act, which opened new leases for fracking. Will you commit to implementing a federal ban on fracking your first day in office, adding the United States to the list of countries who have banned this devastating practice? There's no question I'm in favor of banning fracking. I absolutely support, and over the last four years as vice president, private health care options. You support uh, the Medicare for All bill, I think, initially co-sponsored co by Senator Bernie Sanders. You're also a co-sponsor yes. on, on to I believe it will totally eliminate private insurance. Um, so for people out there who like their insurance, well, they don't get to keep it? Well, listen, the idea is that everyone gets access to medical care. And you don't have to go through the process of going through an insurance company, having them give you approval, going through the paperwork, all of the delay that may require. Who of us have, has not had that situation where you've got to wait for approval and the doctor says, well, I don't know if your, your insurance company is going to cover this? Let's eliminate all of that. Let's move on. The United States Congress, including some of the most conservative members of the United States Senate, came up with a border security bill, which I supported. And that bill would have put 1,500 more border agents on the border to help those folks who are working there right now over time trying to do their jobs. And I think there's no question that we've got to critically reexamine ICE and its role and the way that it is being administered and the work. Anyone that falls for this playbook gets what they deserve, and I think that goes for the entire United States of America. If Kamala Harris is successful in running this playbook, deception, demonization, demographics, and dumbassery, then America will be at her behest in the future. They will vote for the things that they said before they were trying to win this election. They will pack the Supreme Court. They will open up the border. They will give amnesty. They will raise taxes. There will be more crime and more chaos. That's what they believe. What they're saying now is a lie. That's where the deception comes in, and they have no choice. Because if you knew what they actually stood for, there's no way you would vote for them.